I'll be very brief because a lot of people do want to speak and it's a, it's a beautiful day and you want to hear some good speakers behind me. There's a sign out there that many of you are holding that says, we are one, respect our rights. And the communications folks have a sign that says, stand up for workers' rights. Another one is collective bargaining is the American way. Those things are all true. And those are things that Dr. King fought for his entire career in life. There's things that many behind me fought for. There's things that many of you have fought for. Here's the good news though. It's the law. It's the law. That's an applause line. It's the law. Yeah. At least here in Delaware, it's a law. Many of us didn't think we had to be fighting legislative and legal battles around the country, but they are. But here in Delaware, because of you, because of you, we have these basic rights codified in law. The right to organize, the right to collective bargaining, and so many other rights. My job, my job is to enforce the law. To enforce the law on the streets of the city of Wilmington, to enforce the streets on the, on, on the city of Rehoboth, but also to enforce the laws that are codified that ensure workers' rights. So let's keep making sure we fight that fight Thank you for making it the law of this state because your doing so has made for a stronger middle class. A stronger and a stronger middle class means a stronger America. Because it's a middle class that is the backbone of this nation. You are the backbone of this nation. And thank you for making this nation what it is. God bless you and God bless our troops in Afghanistan and Iraq as we speak. Thank you.